Hello, and in this screencast for Apache ISIS, I want to briefly introduce the REST API that the framework automatically provides. So I have the simple app uh, application running. I've got a couple of objects here, and this is the Wicked viewer, you know, designed for human beings to use. Um, but if I go to the home page uh, in a different browser, you can see I also have the Swagger UI. And this is a, a user interface on top of the REST API, but designed for developers to use. Um, and so if I go to the list of services, you'll find that um, for each of the three different actions that we have for the simple objects, that this is all surfaced through the REST API. So for example, I can click on List Invoke and uh, try out, let's go with maybe this different uh, content type, try this out and um, there's the response that we get it's fairly hopefully easy to see and then I could take one of these um, links and uh, number two so in fact what I could just do is uh, go up to uh, simple and I could specify number two and pull that back and there's a representation of, uh, of that particular domain object um, and I can also use uh, the Swagger UI to invoke actions such as uh, create. So this is a bit more interesting. Um, so just to sort of look at what we're doing in the human user interface, I'm just creating a new object, bill. So to do the same thing through the REST API, I can go to this uh, URL and uh, here's the outline and I want to put in say Fred and um, try it out and uh, there's the object that comes back and just to prove we hopefully if we list we can see that there's a uh, Fred as created with an ID number six okay I hope that all made some kind of sense uh, give it a go try it out thanks